hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel if this is the first time you're coming across my channel please subscribe and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so so much for always coming back to watch my content i appreciate please give this video a thumbs up and also comment let me know what you think about today's video on the comment section so in today's video i'm going to show um a tour of my bed sitter apartment in mombasa and um i hope that you're going to enjoy the video and also maybe get inspired to do the same in your own space so welcome let us get straight into the video so it has a metal door as you can see and um, I have this key uh, so I just close it from there then the first thing that you're going to see is this doormat that has that image of a van it looks so beautiful I love the the art in the mat and then those are my shoes so this is how the door looks like and the first thing that you will see on your right after you entered that door is this space so this is uh, what you're going to see so we have that curtain uh, for the kitchen and also you have this storage area where you can put something yeah so it looks like that with some hooks and uh, more hooks here and then this is how the windows look like remember Mombasa is very very hot so these are sliding windows they are really sliding and as you can see the background from the kitchen window is very very beautiful and then um beneath that window we have this water dispenser uh for drinking water it contains fresh water remember that water in mombasa is salty water and then we have this white table and beneath the white table we have this dustbin that um, you just step on it and then it just opens so and then we have this two banner cooker yeah and utensils um the normal utensils glasses cups sufuria spoons cutlery everything and then on this other side we have the sink so the sink has a plastic tap so if you come from mombasa you understand that rusting is real rusting is real yeah so that is why most of these uh, things are in plastic uh, because plastic does not attract rusting yeah so this is the sink area i love the marble top it looks very very elegant and the finishing is very very beautiful also so this means that you can wipe this wall properly without interfering with the paint so um then this is the area where i have stored um the cooking um stuff unga cooking oil salt blue band everything you're seeing there vegetables yeah i had made some tea that is where you can see some tea remaining there so that is how that corner looks like and then we have this socket that i was using to charge our phones yeah because uh, i was using the other sockets for other things i'll show you the others yeah and then we have this socket here with some hooks here so the socket is for the fridge the microwave and i can also use this uh, extension on this socket so we have the chopping board we have the um that spoon and then we have this um hand towel that comes in handy especially after you're done maybe washing the dishes and then we have upper and lower cabinetry as you can see there is lower cabinetry there is upper cabinetry here we have tea bags uh, i think just a few pieces and then here we have wine glasses so um zinaka hivo they look so beautiful and then here we have sufuria yeah it looks like that so um let me close them so then here we have the uh, small fridge and a microwave as you can see and on top of it uh, i just stored a few items anti-malaria tablets because we are just visiting mombasa for a few days this is for my son and then just a few snacks here and there and then here we have a dusting pan and a, a broom so basically that is how the kitchen looks like from the entrance it is the first thing you're going to see 
when you get inside. We are still on the doormat and then you don't want to go to the kitchen you're going to see another doormat there and this uh, flower that looks very very beautiful it's an artificial plant so this welcomes you to the bathroom so we have this door here an entrance of the bathroom and when you get to the bathroom you're going to find this beautiful um, corner that has a sink and um, definitely hand wash and then this is a body wash, I think it's a shampoo or something. And then there is a bucket for you. Then there is this toilet. And then we have a, a tap there that is still plastic. I explained why it is plastic. And then we have definitely shower. And then that is where I have placed my soap. And then definitely the to toilet paper area. Yeah, the normal way um, a toilet should look like and I'm telling you this place is hot. So that is how the bathroom looks like. When you get out or when you get out of the bathroom, uh, this is the match you're going to get and it is very very absorbent so it's nice then on the left side you're going to see this wall that has very very beautiful artwork I love I love 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 them so they look like that that is that wall and um, here we have a seat so this seat is um, is a two-seater it's a two-seater that um, uh, is spacious because I'm just alone with my son. And then we have this table and this carpet. I love the, the patterns of the uh, carpet. They look so beautiful. And then this is the TV area. So the TV area has, uh, has those um, decorations. They look so beautiful also. What do you think about the TV area? And then there is that TV stand, that artificial plant, and that deco or dummy book. Together with these beautiful, beautiful decorations. Yeah, the glass deco. They look so elegant. Together with these flowers. I feel like they look so cool, so beautiful. Yeah. So immediately from that seat you can see a bed so this is the bed it's very very spacious it's big it's the modern type yeah and it's big enough so that is how the bed area looks like uh, the curtains are there and then there is this fan because I said Mombasa is very very hot so it comes in handy when you are uh, resting in the house and maybe you don't want to go outside and you're feeling hot so that is how the the bed area looks like i feel like it's so beautiful yani i love the bed yani iko poor sana what do you think about that bed it's beautiful right so definitely we have the mosquito net because uh, we don't want any problems with uh, malaria yeah so um, from the bed we have this space, from the bed we have this space that has inbuilt wardrobes, I've placed our suitcases, I mean the suitcase there. So we have these um, uh, drawers, we have this section of the wardrobe, yeah that is how the wardrobes look like and then we have this mirror, yeah. That's me and that is a, a bulb for the bedroom or the bedroom side. So it looks like that. 
and then there is a socket there there is a socket two sockets there for charging yeah that is how that place looks like it looks beautiful then we have um, another last room so this is the seat i was showing you and then we have this from this wall we have that door that leads to the balcony the balcony is also very very beautiful as you can see so it contains two seats uh, we have flowers another flower is here and then we have this other flower so what do you think about this so this one i think is supposed to be there and then that is how it looks like So there is this green carpet, Amani carpet grass. Yeah, it looks beautiful. Yeah, we loved, we love it. It's so beautiful. And then this is the window. We did not, we did not close this uh, window from the time we arrived in Mombasa. It's really, really hot. It's really, really hot. So we prefer it staying like that. So I hope that you have enjoyed watching this video. If you have, kindly subscribe, like, share, comment. Let me know what you think about our house tour or our bed sitter apartment tour in Mombasa. I'm going to appreciate your comments. I'm going to see you on my next video. Bye.